Lockheed Martin will develop the SAR-72 Dark Star, a new hypersonic demonstrator aircraft, as part of its Skunk Works or Advanced Development programs to address the needs of the United States Air Force USAF. The high-speed SAR-72 Dark Star aircraft will be designed and manufactured as a replacement for Lockheed Martin's SAR-71 Blackbird, which was retired from service with the United States Air Force in 1998. In 2018, a demonstrator version of the SAR-72 Dark Star hypersonic aircraft is anticipated to be developed. It will be a flight research vehicle FRV with a length of approximately 60 feet and optional piloting. It will be equipped with a single full-scale engine capable of maneuvering at Mark 6 for several minutes. The SAR-72 aircraft will be capable of conducting ISR and strike operations at high speeds. The SAR-72 Dark Star Demonstrator is anticipated to make its maiden voyage in 2023, while the full-scale aircraft will enter service in 2030. The SAR-72 will be a hypersonic strategic reconnaissance aircraft featuring kitting-edge hypersonic technology. It will be designed for missions and ranges comparable to those of the SAR-71. When equipped with hypersonic missiles, such as Lockheed Martin's High Speed Strike Weapon HSSW, the new aircraft should be able to strike targets anywhere on a continent in less than an hour. The aircraft's high speed assures penetration into protected airspace. Optionally, the SAR-72 Dark Star will be outfitted for combat missions. The USAF's long-term hypersonic roadmap is supportive of the aircraft's development. Two engines will propel the SAR-72 unmanned aircraft. The aircraft will receive thrust from its turbine engine until it reaches a speed of Mach 3 after which the dual-mode ramjet will provide propulsion. To reduce aerodynamic drag, the aircraft will employ a single inlet nozzle for both the turbine engine and ramjet. Lockheed Martin Skunk Works is collaborating with Aerojet Rocketdyne on the turbine-based combined cycle TBCC propulsion system, which will enable the aircraft to attain a cruise speed of Mach 6, which is twice as fast as the SAR-71. Subscale ground experiments of the TBCC system were conducted by integrating a small commercially available turbine engine with a dual-mode ramjet or scramjet with an axisymmetric inlet and nozzle.